who discussed Gauss Jordan for 3 by 3. So looking at this system, you will say, not ready. <laughs> I'm not ready. Right? I am not ready. You are ready. No, it's not. It's not. The system is not ready. You are. Good. So let's make it ready. Excellent. Excellent. And the last one is x plus y minus 3z equals negative 2. Very good. Next, we do what? The matrix. Yes, the augmented matrix. Yes. Let's do that. You okay? I don't don't believe him. He's just trying to be funny. Good. Can anyone dictate? Yes. Yes, of course. Sorry, sorry. Perfect. Okay, next step. So we do have this, it's done. So we start by multiplying the first row by something and adding it to the second one, and also by something to multiply by something and add it to the third row. And I'm ready when you are. So which row I have to copy? This is this sequence is very important. Yes, I have to copy it first. I cannot start because I may get confused. I may change that row. Who knows what? Anything can happen. So I have to write it first. Okay, it's there. And then you said negative 1 in both cases. Good. Chris, are you okay? Yeah. Anyone would like to give it a shot? Yeah. Yes. Two. Very good. Two. Very good. Very good. Zero. Do we all agree with zero, negative three, two, and five? <laughs> <They're not. laughs> Do we agree with zero, negative three, two, and five? Everyone? Yes, we agree? Please say no if you don't, and I'll, I'll go back. <laughs> Is this okay, everyone? You can believe that you can say yes. <laughs> you can believe that. Right, okay. Next one. <laughs> yes? Um, 2 times negative 1 is negative 2, plus 1 is indeed negative 1. Very good. And uh, Careful. This is positive 1, but minus 3 is negative 2. And then positive 1 with minus 2 is negative 1. Do we agree? That it's very easy to make a mistake. That's the only difficulty, I think, in this method. The method is pretty straightforward, but it's very easy to make an error. OK, so this is done. Where is my next step? Yes. But I don't really want to divide both sides by okay. negative three. Yes, if I can, if I can um, avoid that. Yes, I'm going to say row two now becomes row three, and row three becomes row two, because I can multiply or divide this one by negative one, which will solve the problem. So first I swap one two negative one negative one zero negative one negative two negative one zero negative three two and five how is that negative one i'm going back i'm doing my math i am i swore i got this one right finally which one so when you uh, so last third row i've done how's that negative okay one? let's do it again so because one that point okay that's fine one times negative one plus one is zero 2 times negative 1 is negative 2, plus 1 is negative 1. Negative 1 times negative 1 is positive 1, minus 3 is negative 2. 
Negative 1 times negative 1 is positive 1. Minus 2 is negative 1. I'd rather go back and check. It's so easy to make mistakes. Don't, <laughs> don't ever hesitate to tell me to go back. Uh, even if you're wrong, I would like you to say do it again, and I, you may see something and I don't. It's very possible. Very good. So now we want this one, not negative one. So what do we do? Yes, multiply row two by negative one or divided by negative one. Same thing. So one, two, negative one, negative one, zero, one, two, one, zero, negative three, two, and five. Done, 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 done. In this step, I have to use a row. Which row? I'm using next row, in other words, row two. What do I need to multiply in order to eliminate this and in order to eliminate that? For this one, I need to multiply by. And for this one, I need to multiply by. Very good. Well, let's take a look. Which row do I have to copy? Yes, because that's the one I'm using. 1 times negative 2 plus 2. 2 times negative 2 minus 1. Awesome. 1 times negative 2 minus 1. Excellent. 1 times 3 minus 3. 2 times 3 plus 2. Awesome. 1 times 3 plus 5. Okay, what follows next? Obviously. Of course. That's it. I have to divide row 3 by 8. 0, 0, 1, 1. Final step. Row 3 times something plus row 1, and row 3 plus something times row, plus row 2. Exactly. We want to eliminate the negative 5. How do I do that? With a 5. I want to eliminate the positive 2. How do I do that? And this is the final step. One times five minus five. One times five minus three. One times negative one plus two. Uh, one times negative two plus two. Sorry, sorry. One times negative two plus one. What is our hope? This is our hope. Our hope is two negative one one. Are you certain? Oh, no. Never. 2, negative 1, 1. I'm sure. 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 I received the presents like that before. So please, do, but please don't do it, please. <laughs> so two, no, no, please, please no. Two minus two is zero. Negative one equals negative one. Two plus one is three, plus one is four. Two minus one is one. One minus three is negative two. So therefore, I will say yes. Any questions about the method? Any questions? Any questions? Say it again. Is all that going to be written out on the desk? Or even as a memorizer? 
the steps. Yeah. Oh, once you do three more problems, you even if you want to forget them, you you won't be able to. I'm afraid I'm going to get over it. But, right, it's very possible. But after you do another four or five problems, you will not. You will not. So let's look uh, again at the um, um, this handout that I gave you a long time ago. So this problem, if you don't have it with you, I have an extra. So uh, we have uh, about uh, 12 minutes left. So please let's work on this problem. And you will see if you understand the method, if you practiced it, it should not take more than three minutes. And this is on page eight. Do we all have this? Anyone needs it? Gary, do you have it? Uh, So it's at the bottom of the page. <laughs> I don't recommend you write them there because you may not have enough room. It's up to you. You may not write as big as I do, so. Don't rush. You don't have to rush. This is this is the type of problem that needs patience. Because going back to correct, it's so difficult. Let me know if you need help. I'm here to you know, come over and help you. just one problem for the entire test. I don't want you to spend three days on it. Did it help, Garrett? Uh, I'm still trying to figure it out. Hold on. Anyone needs help? Please. Don't forget to go back to the original problem and check, please.
You got it? Oh, I have definitely not had it, so. I didn't get it. I have no idea where it went wrong, but I didn't get it. I'm putting the attendance in, I'll be right there. Okay, we're good. Is the elimination method just finding and narrowing down to where you only have? Two, from three to two, a system of two linear equations, yes. Yes. You should be able to do that. But if the method says, if the problem says you have to, then you have to. So this oh, this is negative one. So you are multiplying this row by negative one. Zero times negative one is zero. Minus four is negative four, not negative five. Alright, so let's jump. We have to write instead of negative five, we have to write negative four. Four. So you yes. do this, and then you. So now we multiply by negative one. Negative one times negative one times negative one plus negative one is zero. 1 times negative 1 is negative 1 minus 1 is negative 2. 1 times negative 1, negative 1 plus 1 is 0. 0 times negative 1 is 0 plus 2 is 2, not negative 2. So 0 times, because you're not writing on the side what you're doing, then it gets confusing. You're not multiplying this, you're not multiplying this. You're multiplying the first row by negative <coughs> 1 and add it to the third. The additive. Because you are eliminating this. Because you're eliminating this. Negative 1 plus 1 is negative 2. You're eliminating the first row. So you keep going chronic at the first row. And then you add by negative 1. Negative 1 plus 1 is negative 2. Negative 2 plus 1 is negative 3. Negative 3 plus 1 is negative 4. Negative 4 plus 1 is negative 5. Negative 5 plus 1 is negative 6. Negative 6 plus 1 is negative 7. Negative 7 plus 1 is negative 8. Negative 8 plus 1 is negative 9. Negative 9 plus 1 is negative 10. Negative 10 plus 1 is negative 11. Negative 11 plus 1 is negative 12. Negative 12 plus 1 is negative 13. Negative 13 plus 1 is negative 14. Negative 14 plus 1 is negative 15. Negative Yes. Exactly. Yes. 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 So you multiply the top row by negative one and you add correspondingly. Do we have an answer? I think that's where I'm So you want me to start? I'll yes. This like a different language. Um, that's okay. I don't know. So what was uh, the system? The system was. 
one 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 zero one negative one negative one and negative four and one negative one one and two very good so then I have to write if I don't write you can get confused right so please write what you're doing so negative one negative one one times negative one is negative one of course I have to copy the row I'm working on with one times negative one is negative one plus one is zero negative one minus one is negative two negative one minus one is negative two zero minus four is negative four the negative one with one is zero with negative one negative one minus one is negative two negative one plus one is zero zero plus two is two so this is done now I want I'm working on this what should I do to get the 1 in there? Divide row 2 by negative 2. 1, 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 2, 0, negative 2, 0, 2. Now I'm using this to get these over with. So now it must be row 2 twice for row two for row one and for row three negative one and two do you agree okay which row do I copy yes zero one one two one times negative one plus one one times negative one plus one two times negative one plus zero 1 times 2 minus 2. 1 times 2 plus 0. 2 times 2 plus 2. Excellent. Final step before I divide, after I divide row 3 by 2. One zero. 0, negative 2 has to be copied. 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, and 3. I don't even need to do anything over there. It's already 0. So I only need to multiply row 3 by to add it to row 2. There is no need to do anything for row 1. Negative 1. So um, 1 times negative 1 is negative 1 plus 1 is 0. 3 times negative 1 is negative 3 plus 2 is negative 1. So my hope is negative 2, negative 1, positive 3. I don't know. Maybe. So the system was so negative 2, negative 1, 3. 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 Okay. Negative 2 Minus 1 is negative 3, plus 3 is 0. Negative 2, but plus 1 is negative 1, minus 3 is negative 4. Negative 2 plus 1 is negative 1, plus 3 is 2. So then I will say definitely yes. Any questions?